hi guys welcome back to my channel i know it's been crazy three weeks without posting a video it's crazy but guys life is getting so busy i can't even imagine how busy it it is right now i'm just from dropping my baby at school daycare it's daycare i started taking my baby to daycare because i have to study for my nursing program i have to do my my projects my side hustles and all that and i'm here to just um, keep tabs with you guys and let you know that I am still alive and it's crazy it's just oh my god the days are getting worse it's the winter is almost here we are at uh, fall we are it's fall right now now nah, if we just check it is so dark oh my gosh it's about 10 10 o'clock yeah if you notice my hair it's just crazy it's crazy so somebody asked asked me about my nursing program uh, how it's going on i'm almost finishing my perica site yay please do some clap emojis over there it is not um it is not easy but i've tried and i'm also still working oh my gosh i don't have time i literally don't have time oh my gosh okay so somebody was asking about about how they uh, my nursing program is going on it's going on pretty well but i just made just like two days ago i made a blunder i tried to register for the winter semester so we are new, we are using a new system for our school and i tried to register and put the units on in the shopping cart it's like a new system so it's just crazy you don't know how to use it you just use it on on your own and think that um, you've registered so i put the uh, units in my shopping cart I did not enroll. I did not enroll for winter. Now, yesterday when I checked for the classes, they're supposed to show up where the school, you can see the school fees and the classes that you're going to take. But guess what? Okay, I didn't enroll. Oh my God. So I had to rush, look for emails for these teachers. I've never met them. So you have to go to the website, look into the directory, identify the unit uh, that you're doing. I'm supposed to do biology. Uh, psychology 200 and uh what's this other subject uh i think critical thinking guy i i have to identify the teachers and then um i had to write an email to those teachers luckily two have responded and they're like ah, okay so here in community college or even uni if you miss out um in the class registration period there's a waiting list for like five to twenty people per class so if the teacher has a waiting list, you can actually request a teacher to put you arakaraka because the, the waiting list is for people. You just sign up and you just wait. So if you're not proactive, you might miss out on the class. So I had to ask the teacher, <laughs> write the email. Hi, teacher. Oh, I registered, but I put my units in the cart and I did not enroll. And you know, it's a new system and you know, I have a baby and you know, so you what, what? I only want to do online classes. Two teachers have responded within two days and just one person is missing the psychology class and I'm really hoping she will respond. If she doesn't, I have to write for, to another email, another teacher who has an online class. I think I wrote to both because I really need that feedback right now. Otherwise, you have to register. If you miss out, that's it. Nikama, Nikama Venye Public Uni in Kenya, if, you, if, you, if there's a strike, your classes are shut down. You have to wait for the whole semester. So even here, if you don't register for that unit, my friend, you're not going to do it. But luckily, the semester starts in January when it's snowing. Right now, I registered in November. Right now, in December. So I'm hoping uh, by January 1st, ISO classes and any miss could register. I will register. I mean, I will be enrolled. Like the, uh, the last teacher will, would have enrolled me. No you enroll yourself like they would he or she would would give me will give me a code so if you move out the class the teacher is supposed to give you a code and then you register with the code and then she can see how many people have registered with the code and then she like presses enter and you get into the class it's an online class it's okay i have enjoyed the online classes i don't have time for physical for now but i understand that the full nursing program like the ile koya clinicals which I'm supposed to start in fall of next year, you have to be there physically because 
you're supposed to be in a uniform shoes a stethoscope guys you wait i'll be wearing a stethoscope like a doctor so well we've done some of these things at cnas but so during the nursing you'll be there going to hospital and uh we'll teach her the, the program is like clinicals you're going to do cpr on live people you know and i am looking forward to that and why not this is exciting i wanted to do something different also and something that will matter in the next 10 20 years i don't want to be a nurse for 20 years by the way this is just a means to an end but i am happy about it and i am looking forward to it and i know i'm gonna help so many people like i've always said my i love helping people i love just seeing people grow people around me and i just enjoy seeing the growth of others and also being in the present you know so um i've registered for these units i am good and then i'll do another another video now with my laptop oh my gosh i didn't tell you my laptop crashed yesterday by the way <laughs> my laptop crashed yesterday oh my god I tell you how. so that laptop now i have to call the school and ask for assistance oh my god luckily i have only one more exam remaining for fall it is a uh, biology again we're supposed to do four biology so um, the first biology the exam is eight, uh, it was opened yesterday so i'm going to do it today if the laptop is fixed because the deadline i think is tomorrow and then i'll show you the whole dashboard of which places where we're doing the assignments if you can do it at home for example if you're in kenya or wherever you are in the world and you want to join these classes because right now they're online as an international student i think I think you can do some of the units online excuse me you can do some of the units online and i don't know if you have to 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 move i know you want to move to a different country but if you can do these exams online or units online the better for you because i've seen it's possible you just submit assignment i've never been to school by the way ever since i started i only went once just like the first time the first time before i even started the classes and it's been smooth it's been like three semesters i've done three almost 20 units and it's smooth and i'm fine my grades are fine my grades are okay and you know what by the way i know college is not important for some people who think oh uh, when you have a business you don't have to have college and in any but i feel it's it's important it's my mind is active right now i think a lot like really a lot and i write down stuff and i think I believe college has improved my my communication skills my even oral skills i my friend i would i can tell you i can tell you that like five years ago not five like seven eight years ago my english was terrible like i, I couldn't not well not seven years ago maybe ten years ago <laughs> especially when i was in primary like class eight apple in high schoolish my english was not that perfect but I've realized, especially when I came here and now I've started, I started studying Kabisa Kabisa like serious, my English has really improved. And my communication skills, my mind analytical, oh my gosh, like I tell you guys, I think, I really do think I have like crazy thoughts. And I can attribute that to the way I'm studying and exploring my mind to stuff. Eh? And you're giving your mind time to grow, okay? There's one thing here here in the in this uh, country the the sickness in the, called dementia that one of the one of the thing I've noticed with so many people and clients is that if your world is shut down like you don't have family to talk to you don't read you don't any you don't interact with people your mind starts shutting down if you notice our grandparents in Kenya our mind their minds are still active because they're either going to Gurumod to do um, arrow roots or sweet potatoes or the shamba or the farm or keeping goats and animals, something that keeps them busy. Huku, what keeps them busy is just staying in the house because huku, shamba unalima ya nani? Shamba, where are you? Where are you going to lima the shamba for, for like, who? You're even, you're 60, 70, 80. You don't have anywhere to go. Your kids have left you. And here culture is like, your kids go, they leave you. Okay? So, going to college or reading something um, challenges your mind. And 
you can't say that business is not, uh, college is, is not everything. If you have, if you don't have a business, if you haven't attended any college or post high school education, please, no, don't say that. Just try engage your mind, read something. Um, try engage your mind in doing something. That way, you you learn pole pole, okay? And that's why I chose back to go to school. And I know it's not the last time, but it's a good stretch amount of time, like three, four years to go to school, then stay for like five, six, seven years. But I'll be working and of course teaching my baby. Yo, school is great. I love it. Of course, they make the exams for you to fail, but you don't have to fail. But you just have to learn. Even if the people who fail in our high schools or nini, come come to think of it, there's some people who got A's in, in school, but today they're nowhere. Others got C and D's and E's and they're the leaders in our country or, okay, not politicians, but in terms of private sector, the, it can turn. Whether you go this way or that way, education will never um, leave you, you know? If there's only thing, if there's one thing you want to invest in yourself is your education, whether it's going to class or reading or studying something or learning something from anywhere from a friend that is the number one thing that cannot come from out of your brain okay so if you if if it's possible you can invest in yourself and so i'll be showing you the dashboard in my next video to show you that um the subject like the way they arrange them there's a system called canvas ctc link the new one yeah, and stuff like that. And I have missed you guys. So if you like this video, hit the smash like, uh, the smash, no, hit smash the like button and subscribe. And I will really appreciate. Okay, guys, I'll see you in the next video. Peace.